morning everyone welcome back to alleyways or if it's your first time here welcome to my channel thank you so much for taking the time off this video and if you haven't already please 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 make sure to join the alleyways family subscribe to my channel give this video a big thumbs up and turn on post notifications so you know when i have new content okay <laughs> it's only seven it's not really that early but you guys we're going to paris so I wanted to go to Paris for years and years. It was one of like the things that was on my vision board for last year. So when Monroe surprised me with this trip to Paris for Christmas, I was just beside myself. Obviously, I need to get ready. So let's go get ready and get to the airport. All right, we are all ready. Here is my airport outfit. I have this sweater hoodie from Pink Lily. These are from Amazon. You guys, I just got these new tennis shoes. I hope y'all can see them from Pink Lily that I absolutely love. Um, those are gonna be my main tennis shoes for the trip. I did layer on a tank top underneath that coordinates with the sweatpants. Cause planes, you don't ever know if they're gonna be hot or freezing. And then I am traveling in my coat to save room in my suitcase and I just have my mom's all weather cream coat. Um, yeah, I just have a few more things to do and then we are using Earth Rides to pick us up. And if you follow me on Instagram, you know how much I love Earth. It was founded right here in Nashville uh, by an awesome woman. And essentially they are a rideshare company, but the company owns the cars themselves and then they hire drivers to drive their cars. And every car is a Tesla, so it's, you know, very environmentally friendly. You can schedule a ride ahead. The pricing is on par with Uber or Lyft, and it's just always a really nice experience. So Earth is expanding. If you have it in your city, I really highly recommend them. I'm just gonna go, okay, like make up the bed, do a few other things, and then we'll get on the road. Okay, I think we're ready. Are you ready? I'm ready. This is the best Christmas gift ever, by the way. <laughs> Stage right. <laughs> Look at our bags. We've got... Just a few. Yeah, just... Actually, I we did better than I thought we would. Monroe got just one big suitcase and a carry-on. Of course, I have two big suitcases and a carry-on in my backpack. And I got new luggage, you guys. And then of course I had to get luggage cover since I wanted white luggage. So I will link these um, from Amazon in my storefront. But yeah, now we're just waiting on our, our ride. Hey fam, we are in our Earth ride. We're here with Hunter. Hey Hunter. Hello, hello. Good morning. <laughs> I love riding with Earth because they're always on time. Everybody's so sweet. The cars are amazing. Always safe. It's just like, if you're in Nashville, it's the absolute best way to get wherever you need to go. Just trust me on this. I will put a link to um, get the app in the description box down below, but we are almost at the airport now. So smooth sailing so far. We're hoping for a good travel day. All right, we made it to the Nashville airport. It's super hot in here. Like very, very hot in here. I'm already at my tank top. But I am team get to the airport late. He's team get to the airport early. What team are you guys? For now, we got our first flight. We're going to Chicago and then from Chicago to Paris. But we got a little bit of a layover in Chicago. But I think that for now, I'll sign off to our next flight. How do you like this? It's great. So with our flight, we get to come into the American Airlines lounge, I guess. I've never been in one of these. You guys, we went and like ate lunch at a restaurant stupidly. They have a whole buffet in here. Tons of great stuff, but we've been in this room laying on these lounges. And I've been editing videos, but it's so great in here. I would take you guys around, but it's pretty crowded once you get up to like the area where the food is. But such a nice park, and now it makes me really want to get one of these credit cards. Okay, fam. 20, no, 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 I'm sorry. 17 hours later, we are here, we are in our room. So let's do a quick room tour. So this is room number 615 at our hotel. This room is amazing. I like almost cried when we came in. So you come in and the first thing is a little sitting room. I'm gonna try and like walk around so you guys can see. Because um, I know the light coming in right now makes it a little bit difficult. Here's our coffee bar uh, and mini bar. Look at that, how gorgeous it is. Our bar cart. And then they were so sweet and gave us some um, champagne and pastries when we got here. Monroe, what'd yeah. you think? 
good, I huh? I think it's amazing. I think so too. And, and then you have like four little balconies. Yeah, we have so many terraces, look. And then look, there's our view of the Eiffel Tower. So gorgeous, there's a little bookcase. And then you walk through this hallway and this is the closet with a safe. I can show you guys, kind of. I don't have a room tour, probably on TikTok or Instagram at some point with like a wide angle lens. That'll be a little bit smoother. Then we move into the bedroom. We do have a king size bed. There's a television in this piece of furniture here. We just got our luggage. We are desperate for a shower. We've got another terrace balcony there and there. I think we have five total, Monroe. Really? Yeah. And then here is our bathroom. And I've just opened these terrace doors. Um, we're right across from the U.S. Embassy right there. But look. Oh. Wow. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Yeah, not a bad place to uh, take a bath, huh? We've got our shower here. It's a nice big shower. And then a water closet here. And there is the bathtub. So it's an incredible room. We're actually feeling really great. We slept the whole time on the flight, but now we're just like in absolute desperate need of a shower and then lunch. So let's go do that. I will hopefully see you guys when I'm looking and feeling a little bit better. Hey, we showered, got ready, and now we are going to go find lunch. We are really close to Angelina Paris, so I really have always wanted to go there to try the hot chocolate. So hopefully we can get in, but if not, we'll find somewhere. You're looking sharp, Monroe. You too. Thank you, let's go. Okay, we walked down here, it's like right at 12.30, and I'm gonna show you guys, look at the line. So the line goes for a while, right now we're just waiting. We're gonna look and see what else is around here and see if there's somebody else somewhere else we can kind of go to nearby. Um, but I'll keep you guys posted because I've always really, really wanted to try Angelina, but we'll see. We made it to the front of the line. It took 37 minutes, but for a while the sun was out, so we were just enjoying standing out here in the sun. But yeah, look, now we're up here. How beautiful. Okay, we've been seated. It is gorgeous in here. Absolutely gorgeous. And I have to say, when I got mine, I wasn't hungry, and now I am like ravenous. Of course, we gotta get hot chocolate. That's what they're famous for here. But then we're gonna take a look at the menu and see what else we can find. Okay, here is a look at the menu. As always, I'm gonna just go slow. So if you guys wanna pause or screenshot. Um, we do have dinner in just a little bit, so I'm going to be getting the onion soup you see on this page, and of course, hot chocolate. Might have to try a pastry. But it's a really good looking menu. Fam, here it is. I'm gonna do one more pour so you guys can see. Look at that. I have wanted to go to Angelina's and have hot chocolate since my neighbor talked about it when I think I was in the eighth grade. Oh, here we go. Flip that up and let me see it. Ah, you want the pizza? Okay. Oh my goodness. We got bread. We got soup. This hot chocolate was so good that I know right now while I'm drinking it, I will think about it for the rest of my life. I realize this is a touristy thing to do, but it's something that I've heard about and wanted to do, and I'm just really happy I got to experience it. It did not disappoint me. It does, you're right. Sometimes it does. It lives up to the height. Monroe said it best when he said, some places just live up to the hype. It was worth it. Delicious. Constance was our waitress, our server. She was absolutely lovely. Now we're both getting so tired. 
So we're gonna go back to the hotel, take a little nap, and then we are going to go to the Eiffel Tower at five, and we're doing a river cruise tonight for dinner at eight. So we feel like we need to rest up just a bit before we, you know, <laughs> make it to 11 o'clock here. All right, you guys, it is 2.30. We're gonna get a little nap, get up, and we'll be ready to go. So I'll see you guys then. Okay fam, we have rallied. We are up and about. It's getting cold out. I went ahead and just like bundled up and we are headed to the Eiffel Tower. We're gonna walk up the steps right now. You can't take the elevator. They're doing some renovations, I think, for the Olympics. And so you are only able to take the stairs up to a certain floor. But we're gonna go do it because uh, it's my first time here and uh, it's something you just have to do, right? So bundled up and we're going to go over there and then we're actually coming back because I have to get ready for dinner before even though we're meeting right over by there, but let's go. Okay, I didn't think we, wasn't sure that we would, but we rallied, didn't we? We did. And check it out. All right, so now we just have to be ready to get our steps in. I'm wearing new shoes that I got from Pink Lily that I absolutely love. I will link them in the description box down below. Um, so far, really comfortable, but we gotta walk up some serious stairs. <laughs> so we'll really put them to the test. But on the drive over here, we got to see uh, the Opera House, and we actually passed under the bridge and kind of tunnel where um, Princess Diana passed away, which was so sad. But somebody's done a painting uh, underneath there of her, which I thought was a nice, nice tribute. But. We're excited. I'm proud of us, Monroe. Yeah, that was not me for us. It was really hard to get out of bed, but we're doing it. All right, here we are. Oh, check out the coral. Oh yeah, underneath here, there's like a really nice little pond. Monroe is of course appreciating the wildlife. Came for the tower, stayed for the ducks. <laughs> we made it to the first floor. I'm still a little out of breath, but it took us, what, five minutes? No, oh, no, it wasn't bad at all, like ten minutes maybe. Not even. Just Stairmaster. I know, we're earning those pastries we're going to eat, but now, look. Look, there is an igloo up here that you can go into without a reservation, I think. And then I believe this is the Jules Verne, the restaurant that they have um, in the Eiffel Tower that you can eat in. Looks beautiful. Monroe, is that the Jules Verne? It looks like... No, it looks like Madame Brasserie. Yeah. There's a bistro here. There's a lot going on up here in the Eiffel Tower. I don't know what I thought it would be like, but there's a lot more businesses. Than, uh, than I thought there would be. Here's the safe blue. Looks like a cozy place to stop in for like a drink or a little snack. The restaurants all look gorgeous. Oh, that's my all right, here we are. All the way up at the second floor. It is absolutely beautiful up here. Gorgeous, it's starting to rain a little. I think that. I think yeah. my legs are shaking, or yours. Just a little bit of nausea for me, but... <laughs> the views were amazing. And I would say if you feel like... I would, I would just say this, there's no line for the stairs. If you're wanting like a quick visit, but you could like handle the stairs, just go for it. It was really nice. Um, beautiful views, and easy enough. Very, very cool. I feel like it's a bucket list item, so. Now we are just going to walk back to our hotel because we've got some time before we have to be there for dinner. So we thought we'd enjoy a walk together. All right, we are walking back to our hotel now. It started to rain, 
We're walking along the Sim. We're coming right back here in a little bit for our dinner cruise, but we thought, well, we'll get some more steps in, stretch our legs, have a little, cool down. yeah, our cool down workout. Look how gorgeous the sky looks. It's like pink and blue. And I think the Eiffel Tower lights up on the hour for like five minutes. So if it lights up while we're still walking, we'll definitely film it for y'all. Okay fam, it's sparkling. Look how gorgeous. This is my little new coat I just got and I have a cute dress on. I'll try and show you guys later, but yeah, we're running late. Let's go. Okay, we made it, fam. We are here getting on to Bateau Freezy, and as you can see, there's a big line, but you kind of just make sure that you look, if you're doing a river cruise, they're gonna bring you down to this dock. Make sure that you look at the website of your dinner cruise to get your dock number. So we were able to tell our cab driver that we're going on Bateau Creasy and add of number eight, and he pulled us right up over here and dropped us off really close to the front, which is really nice, especially when it's cold, or on a night like tonight when you want to wear heels to dinner. So now we're just waiting to be seated. We got the privilege service, so we have a guaranteed window seat, and I think it comes with maybe a drink of choice. Uh, but once we get inside, I will show you guys a little look at the menu. So there's basically like four options and starters, um, entrees, and then there's cheese and dessert. So we're really excited. We think it's going to be very romantic. We made it onto our boat. You can see. It's a rainy night out there, and there's like a, a big light on right here, but I think that it should get turned off in just a few minutes, so we're really able to see out. But let's take a look at the menu now. Alrighty, here is a look at the menu. As always, I will go slow, so you guys can pause and screenshot. But like I said, basically with the package that we got, we just pick one item from each portion of the menu. This is a look at everything you see along the way. Again, I'm going to go slow so you can pause and screenshot. So you get to see 12 different landmarks. And as far as dinner, I'm going to try the escargot tart from over here. I'm going to go to the sea bass filet have to have cheese and then I think I'm gonna do the black forest gateau for dessert. Sir, have you decided what you are gonna get? No. Okay, look at the menu. Alright, we just started with a little cheese ball. They brought us glasses of champagne. You guys know that I don't really drink and I wanted to kind of substitute it for a coke but they brought it before I could ask. But if you do like champagne then you'll appreciate that. And then there is a live singer up there. I don't know if you guys can hear her, but she's really great. So let's go try this cheese pastry and see what we think. Ladies and gentlemen, here is my appetizer. We'd like to welcome you on board. Life here jackets is Monroe. are under your seats. These jackets are only. Okay, so the little cheese tart thing was really, really good. reviews of people that said the food was not good, but overall, I think that it's fine. I'll let you guys know as the night goes. Service has been nice, it's been really quick, and you guys know I get motion sick really easily, but I'm doing really well. Everything feels really smooth, and I did take a dram of meat, so that's pretty good. All right, here is a look at my sea bass. And Monroe got the guinea fowl. Thank you, Monroe, coming through. 
So let's go see how it is. We've been really just enjoying, we're getting really tired sitting here, but we've really been enjoying watching all the sights. Fam, here is our cheese course. Our entrees were good. I would definitely say that Monroe's is better than mine. So if you come on this exact same excursion, then I can link it below. I don't have a partnership with anything. Um, but I would definitely recommend the Guinea Fowl. This was really good. It kind of tasted like turkey and dressing on Thanksgiving. It was really good. I'm excited for this cheese, so let's go. Alright, we have the gateau and the Mont Blanc. The cheese was amazing. Here's a little fit check, just to... by the way. I got this headband from Pink Lily Boutique. I'll link everything, um, plus any discounts. This is my dress. I'm a sucker, I'm gonna try and get back where y'all can see. I'm a sucker for ostrich feathers, and this had ostrich feathers around the wrist, and around the skirt, and then, hold on, I'll show y'all my, here's a kind of a better look too at the dress. Has this really dramatic collar, I hope y'all can see, and a keyhole neck. And then I'm wearing my dream pair, as little fuzzy shoes. So this is tonight's look, I loved it. All right fam, we are back. Word to the wise, do not take the cabs that park outside um, the dock because they were trying to charge us $45 for a cab ride. Um, that is literally five minutes away. Just walk up the hill and it'll be like, walk up the hill, there's a taxi stand by a little cafe and you'll be so much better off. Um, the river cruise was very nice. The ambiance was great. Um, the service was wonderful. Our servers were super friendly. The food was a little bit of a miss, which I had read online. The dessert was great, the bread was great, the cheese was great. I just feel like if I was, if I'm just, in, to be totally honest with you guys, the appetizer and entree were a little bit weak, but I had a great time. It's a great way to just get out and get to see a lot of the city in one very touristy stroke. It's also a really romantic environment. So we had a great time. Now we're back at the room and we're absolutely exhausted. We have a big, big day tomorrow. So I'm gonna go get ready for bed, but I'll see you guys in the morning. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. A special thank you as always to my live chat crew. Live chat crew, I love you so, so much. And I can't wait to see you next time right here on Alleyways. Bye.